What time is it? It's fertilizing time. That's stupid. It's fertilize. No. It's fertilizing time. My name's Sierra the Festive Bohemian, and today I'm going to be fertilizing my plants that I have here in Lekka. So I've got quite a few plants now in Lekka, and it has been about four weeks or so since I transitioned my first plants. I have been noticing some new growth on them, and so today I'm gonna go ahead and fertilize for the first time. What I'm gonna be using is the Fox Farm Trio. So it's these three that you get. Now the reason I specifically went with Fox Farm is because I saw that it can be used for hydroponic and soil plants. I'm not sure if all hydroponic fertilizer can do that, but I um, am intending to use this for not only my plants in Lekka, but also the plants I still have in soil. Okay, so you've got the grow big. Now the grow big, it says that you can add this to your reservoir every time you change it, and I'm changing the reservoir every week, so I'm going to be feeding this to my plants every week. Now it's okay if you forget a week here and there, but I'm gonna try to be as consistent as possible and I'm gonna actually use this in combination with the other two. Now, these two say they can be applied every other week. The Big Bloom says it's gentle enough to use throughout all stages of plant growth and the Tiger Bloom is specifically designed to help with plants that are in bloom. So it says to apply once the first sign of buds appear. So you can use them simultaneously with one another, but what you do want to remember is that you do only want to use a quarter strength. The bottle here says to use two teaspoons per a gallon of water. So two teaspoons per gallon of water, and instead I'm going to only be using half a teaspoon per gallon of water because with fertilizer you can do too much it can kill your plant so a good idea is to do a quarter start at a quarter of a strength and you can kind of gradually work your way up I'm just gonna do the grow big and the big bloom I am gonna save the tiger bloom for you know when I do see those uh, buds start to appear actually I probably We'll use it with um, an orchid that looks like it's about to bloom. So maybe I'll do another batch as well. I'm just gonna mix these two up, which I already did. I did a uh, half a teaspoon, half a teaspoon of the Grow Big mixed with one tablespoon of the Big Bloom in a gallon of water. Here's my fertilizer mixture. The best way to do this if you had a jug, like a gallon jug, of water but um, I don't have one of those so I also have a watering can with the measurement there so that's what I used what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to remove all my plants from their little reservoirs and I'm going to empty them out and I'm going to replace them with the new water fertilizer solution and I'm also probably going to give them a little rinse through to remove any of the debris or maybe roots that may have fallen off or died off in the process of converting them and yeah I'm honestly not going to check the roots this time around because I noticed a lot of new growth on these two especially and I just don't want to disturb the roots too much they've kind of already been through a little bit since I first took them out so I'm gonna let them chill and then gonna give them their first dose of fertilizer. I've got our fertilizer in here now just to make it easier to pour. Converting all your plants to LECA means you've really got to be on top of your fertilizing game because since LECA is an or inorganic substrate there's no nutrients in it for our plants so we need to provide them for it and we do that by giving it some fertilizer. Now we water. So, and you refill 
your reservoir to that one third mark, which you really just gotta eye where that is. There we go. One down, several to go. <laughs> Cleaning out the container first. Look how much happier she's looking. If you saw my Lekka update video, <laughs> she was looking really sad, but since then she's uh, shot up some new growth here, new leaves, so nothing to worry about. Just me overreacting as per usual, right? I feel like I've learned the strategy with Lekka is just to remain calm. That's how you win <laughs> with like Just have patience and remain calm and you will be okay. I think that looks about right. All right, all right, all right. Well, I'm gonna keep going. This bad boy, fill her up. And if you're fertilizing plants that are in soil, the amount will still be the same. The only difference is I would wait a little bit longer before you fertilize your plants because when you get them from the nursery, you don't know if they've already been fertilized recently and also they're likely in ni some nice fresh soil that has a lot of nutrients that are going to take that plant and he'll be fine for quite some time. Alright guys, I hope this video helps make fertilizing your plants a little easier, a little less intimidating and if it did help you, make sure to hit that thumbs up and let me know it really also helps support the channel and i greatly appreciate it don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy content like this because i come out with a new video every week yes every week hit that subscribe button and i'll see you next week thanks guys